Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back once again. It is Mimolt. So happy to be here with you guys today. As always, we are playing some vain glory, guys. I am rolling with Saw, and we absolutely annihilate and go to town in this match. So we're going to start off, I'm going to pick off my CC ability as the second one, um, and then I'm going to grab that Book of Eulogy since I'm going to be playing in the lane. Um, with the Book of Eulogies, you get a little bit of a heal every time that you deal a killing blow. So it's great if you're going to be playing lane. Uh, as a ranged um, as a ranged character it definitely works really really well so me and Ringo are coming up into the lane I believe that I ping on the map and tell him to leave and eventually he does because uh, Saul works best yeah there I go telling him to avoid it but he just goes and hangs out anyways uh, in my opinion Saul works best in the lane by himself uh, because he can rack up and just level up so, so fast. He can get so much gold and just work through all these guys. You can see me getting last hits on a lot of that stuff. But we are just going to push up the lane a little bit here. Obviously, the gameplay is going to be a little slow off the bat. But you'll see right here, <clears throat> as I build those stacks up on the left side, my guy gets a lot slower. So you have to back up as you notice the turret starting to focus you. Here the enemy Ringo comes in. I use my second ability, which is my CC or crowd control ability and it slows down that Ringo. I'm not going to chase him because it's not really worth it. He's just going to waste time messing around and have to go back and heal up. So I am perfectly fine with that. We're going to go ahead and focus down some more of these lane minions, and then I'm going to start ticking away at the, uh, at the turret as well just so that we can start working our way in. Now we do, uh oh, we've got a Glaive coming from the back right here. You can see that the uh, the turret almost targeted me, but Glaive actually messed up and shot me out of range of it. I'm going to use my second CC ability right there again. You saw him slow down. Uh, it's very important to to use that wisely. Um, it works really, really well. It does an okay amount of damage, but it's definitely better at just slowing them down. Here comes there Ringo. He's coming in to try and test me, and I'm like, uh, excuse me, so I'm going to use my first ability right there, but he actually gets taken out before I can do it. That first ability is awesome. It can either be used as an escape tool where you can run away, or it can be used to chase down um, an enemy character. You can see that I led that cruel right there with my second ability because I saw him chasing my character, so I aimed a little bit in front of him, so he ran into it, and then he ran back out, so he was in it for a long time actually. I'm going to back up here because my uh, mana is falling down a little bit as well as my health. Now I do want to keep on getting as much gold as possible. Guys, it is very important to stay active in this game and not just uh, wait too long for things to happen. So here we go. I'm going to go ahead and <laughs> help once again with two assists, take out that glaive. Ringo's getting all the final kills on that, but that's all right. Um, I used that second ability again, guys, which slowed him down from running away, and it also caused a good amount of damage. So I'm going to go ahead and put another point in that, and we are going to continue working our way on. But I am all out of mana right here, so I'm going to head on back. I've got 1,000 gold. I'm going to go back up to recommended and just buy my six sins and my weapon blade and start building toward that sorrow blade, which helps me do a lot more damage. So we're just going to slowly work our way out. Guys, when it goes to the store, generally you can go with the recommended route, or as you begin to play and get used to characters, you can go out of the recommended route. One thing that I always get for Saw since he is so slow is boots. Um, you'll see me buy that, I believe, either the next one or the one after that when I stop at the store because initially it's only 300 gold, which isn't that much, and it helps a ton. So there we go, using that second ability again. I'm going to kind of hang back here by my turret. Cruel is pretty deadly, but honestly, he's not that deadly in the lane, so I'm not too worried about him. Uh, he works better in the jungle because he can level up very, very quickly in the jungle. Um, he is one of my favorite characters to play. Him and Saw are a lot of fun. Cruel is definitely deadly as he levels up, and you have to be very, very careful with him. So I'm going to go ahead and follow uh, this Ringo over here because I noticed that there's another Ringo. We're going to use that first ability, as you can see, used to catch up there. And then once again, I come out with another assist. I used that ability too late because I wasn't expecting our Ringo to get that killing blow on him. But that first ability, guys, is awesome. Uh, it makes you sprint towards the character, and if it doesn't complete, or if you don't make contact with them, then all it is is pretty much another sprint, like your boots. But if you do make contact with them, it's a great way to do a load of damage and to get out of dodge. So right after you hit them, you can back out. Um, it works great also if you're being chased by somebody, you can go hit them, and it'll shoot you back the opposite direction, even further than where you were, and it'll confuse them a little bit because they might think you're trying to come in and um, and do damage and fight some more, but it's really just another great way to escape 
um, and try and save your life. So we are 0 and 3 right now. It's still working in the lane. I'm level 4. Here comes a Glaive, and we're going to focus him down right here. I messed up with that second ability, but Cruel messes up as well. You can see his little stackable ability that he had on top of me right there, but he used it too soon. And then we are going to get a double kill right there, guys. We're going to take out that Cruel and that Glaive. Both of them got a little crazy. I am all out of mana, though. Um, so we are going to have to go back pretty soon to build that up. But since I know that we just took out both of them, we're going to come up here and we're just going to passively attack this turret, just do a little bit of damage to it. You can see we've only got two minions left, so I'm going to go ahead and back out. But then here come the other one, so we're going to head back in and try and finish this off. But that Cruel is there, and he is deadly right now. I've got to get away from him so, so close. He made a bad decision right there and went after that Ringo instead because, as you can see, he had two points on the top of my head, and he could have taken me out. So we're going to head on back here. I've got 1,400 gold um, from killing all those minions. We're going to go ahead and get those boots right there, the travel boots, because like I said, I hate being slow. So we're going to go ahead and purchase those, wait for our mana and everything else to fill up, and then head right on back out. My guy was about to do push-ups again. But we are absolutely um, being really, really effective right now and just doing things well. You can see there's a glaive, I believe, um, in the lane right now. And um, I think I got a, a text or something right there. But we're going to come up in here. We've got a whole bunch of minions for us to just build up our stacks with. The stack is on the left side, guys. In the bottom left, you can see it says three, four right there, five, six. And as that begins to stack, you shoot faster, but you slow down. So you need to be very, very careful with that. We're going to go ahead and get our ult or our ultimate ability right here. That's the third one right there. What that does is a lot of damage, and each shot gives you, I believe it's two stacks towards your um, overall spin. So um, it's really, really great if you have your spin built up to 12 and you turn that thing on, you can, take, you can easily get a triple kill um, if there aren't any minions around and you're not stunned or anything like that. So um, we're about to take out this turret, me and Ringo are, and then we are going to continue working on these minions. You can see we've got a huge herd of minions with us fixing to go to town and thankfully we took out that turret before they got there because otherwise they would have gotten a lot of AOE damage which wouldn't have been too good because then they would have all been low health. So we're going to head on over here and you can see their glaive is right there. He comes up too far. Uh, I use that CC ability once again and then we are going to try and focus him. I use my ult but he gets out of range. So you have to be careful with your ult. I'm going to go ahead and focus this cruel down with it. One, two, three and he gets away. Where's he going? We're going to turn around. We're going to focus him down right there. One shot. And then as you can see that used all of my ult missiles. Um, now you can uh, keep the ult missiles uh, until you use them all as long as you don't die. So you have to be careful not to waste them on minions. So that's why you saw me back up right there because I didn't want to accidentally attack minions or anything. We're going to go ahead and focus this Ringo down right here real quick because he attacked me and then my minions get in there and he just gets annihilated in like three seconds. Once again, we are running out of mana, so we've got to be careful. I'm going to go ahead and head back right here because this Cruel is coming after me. I use my boots to get out of town. And we are going to head back because we've got a lot of gold to spend and we were out of mana. So we're going to go ahead and go back by this Sorrow Blade, guys, and then wait on our mana to regen for us. And then we are going to head on out. Um, so we're doing really, really well right now. Uh, 4 and 0 and 3. And our team is doing well as well. <laughs> I just said well like five times. But we're going to work our way back down the lane. We're just going to stay in the lane for the majority of the game, guys, because... Um, it's, it works really, really well for us as Saw, having all these minions, being able to build up our spin. We almost get that Cruel right there. We're just going to keep our spin up uh, on these minions, and then we are going to go ahead and take out this Ringo once again, and then we are going to head in here and get an assist on that Glaive with our first ability, guys. Um, if you want to play Saw, definitely try them out. you got to be careful again because, remember, you get slow. You get really, really slow, and uh, many characters can chase you down, especially if you have boots. So that's why it's very important to uh, pay attention to whether you have your first ability up so that you can escape when you need to, or you need to make sure that you have boots, um, especially if you're going to be getting into combat with people that you need to escape. Now, we just take out that Ringo very, very easily, get an assist on it, uh, that turret focused me. I'm going to head out and come back just to make sure I get out and they think I'm gone. We're going to go ahead and focus on this glaive right here and take him down right there. And then we're just going to keep on rolling around. We've got all three of us up here together um, and we are just 
hanging out, taking out this turret. And right now you can see I'm just kind of moving around, seeing what's going on, waiting on uh, that cruel to get there. I attack him and I almost get taken out by that turret. So you have to be very, very careful when it comes to that. You can see over on the left side, I still have three more of my um, ult missiles available. We're going to go on back. We're going to buy that sword right there. And again, guys, we still have those three missiles available. So it's very important to pay attention to that as you move on because you don't want to waste that on minions. Um, <laughs> we're going to go ahead and head out. Again, we got an immense gold payout from the uh, gold mine, uh, and we are going to head on out and try and take this out, guys. We are 5 0 oh, 6, doing a really, really good job. Normally, when I play Saw, I don't get this many assists, but I'm perfectly fine with it. We're going to go ahead and build up our ult ability, guys. It's very important to build that one up, in my opinion, um, every chance that you get because it is your best ability. Um, I always, always try and put points in that as often as I can. Now, I see this other character down here at the gold mine. We're going to go down and take them out. So you can see that there are two of them, though, but we're going to go ahead, use this ability, slow them down, and uh, we have our ult available, and we just... Well, actually, we don't have our ult available, but we go ahead and take out that glaive. We're going to focus on this cruel, and he <laughs> gets absolutely crushed as our spin goes up. He had one stack on me uh, when it comes to his ability, and we just aced them. So you can see our health going up as well as our mana. So we're going to head in here with our herd of minions and just go to town. Again, guys... Um, the, here comes a Glaive from their base, and this right here is the one point where I actually get overwhelmed. So we're going to take out that Glaive, and then I'm going to focus on this Ringo. Their Cruel does a great job of rolling over to me and taking me out. So I'm 7-1-7 seven, and seven right now, guys. If we had had one more second, we definitely would have taken out that Ringo because we had our ult ability up and running, guys. We are only at 12 minutes right here. The Kraken comes out at 15 uh, so we are doing a great, great job as a team. It was played very, very well. Um, it wasn't too bad having Ringo in the lane. Uh, obviously, I wish that he wasn't in there because I would have gotten more gold. But whenever they came up and worked together, we did a really, really good job. Uh, we've got 1,900 gold right now. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and use this sprint because we're running out of time, and I'm not too worried about it. Again, you can use it as a damage dealing thing or as a speed boost to get you places. So I used my boots as well as that number one ability. And it's always, it is already up by the time I get back over here to their base. So we're going to go ahead and get our spin up. We're going to start working on these minions, but it is only me right now over in their base. So I have to be careful because I don't want to get outnumbered. So I'm going to head down here, go ahead and head over to the minion miner on their side so that we can... Uh, start building up our minions so that they are stronger and we can just get one final push, guys. So one thing that you do want to do with the mini miners is if you're pushing, you want to have both of them if you're pushing lane because they are going to help drastically. Now, if you are trying to farm for gold towards the beginning, then I wouldn't get the minion miner. Um, I would let them have them because then the minions are worth more and you can get more gold, which means you're going to get better gear, which means you're going to win. We're going to go ahead and take out that cruel right there. I am 7, 1, and 9. We're going to take out... Oh, I guess that wasn't cruel. We're going to take out that cruel. Uh, that was Ringo. And I get shot one time right there, but I'm not too worried about it. Our minions are going to come in and get too distracting them. I'm going to go ahead and build up my spin right here. And this is actually pretty hilarious uh, what happens now. We're going to go ahead and take out their crystal. But before the game is over, uh, <laughs> we're 7, 1, and 10 right now. Before the game is over, Saw is just going to destroy two more. 8, and 1, and 10. 9, and 1, and 10, guys. That was an awesome game. I hope that you all learned a lot. Uh, definitely enjoy playing it. Keep on working, guys. You're going to get a hang of it. Again, I hope that you enjoyed. And as always, make sure you keep calm and play on for me, right? I'll see you guys later. Peace.